to my tummy, tummy, tummy. All right. The actual mechanism that causes browning in apples and produce involves an enzyme called polyphenol oxidase, also known as tyro tyrosinase. The browning reaction results from the oxidation of the phenolic compounds in the fruit under the action of an enzyme called polyphenol oxidase, which is common in plant tissues. Once you cut the fruit, you open some of the cells. The enzyme then has access to oxygen in the air, and it does its thing, turning the fruit brown. This is the same thing that causes brown spots in apples when you drop them. The easiest way to prevent browning is to put the sliced apples in water so that the enzyme does not have access to oxygen. You can also heat the apples to denature the enzyme. In humans, tyrosinase is also important because it creates melanin, which causes tanning. The lack of tyrosinase in humans leads to albinism. So in humans, the browning that tyrosinase helps cause is actually a good thing. Quinones are compounds having a full conjugated cyclic dione structure, such as that of benzoquinones, derived from aromatic compounds by conversion of an even number of hydrocarbon groups into carbonyl groups with any necessary rearrangement of double bonds. Polycyclic and heterocyclic analogs are also included. Fruit browning, as a consequence of bruising, is due to phenolic oxidation. The destruction of fruit cellular compartmentation allows the phenolic substrates to be accessible to polyphenol oxidates, which catalyze the phenolic oxidation. The concentration and composition of phenolic compounds and or activity of the PPOs are often the major factors determining tissue browning development and intensity. Furthermore, natural chemicals with antioxidant properties, such as thio compounds, may also play an important role in fruit browning development. The main reason that an apple doesn't turn brown before it, it is cut is that the skin of the apple keeps oxygen outside. In addition, the PPO and the phenols are generally located in different cells inside the apple. This reaction is known as enzymatic browning and occurs at warm temperatures when the pH of the plant material is between 5 and 7. The reaction is also speeded up by the presence of iron, such as an iron or rusted knife, or copper, such as a copper bowl. The reaction can be slowed or prevented by inactivating the enzyme with heat, reducing the pH on the surface of the fruit, reducing the amount of available oxygen, or using cutlery that has some corrosion as in as is seen with lower quality steel knives. This can increase the rate and amount of the browning by making more iron salts available for the reaction. In conclusion, apples contain an enzyme called polyphenol oxidase or tyrosinase that cause them to turn brown. The enzymes react with oxygen and iron containing phenols that are also found in the apple. The chemical reaction is called oxidation. The reaction can be slowed or prevented by inactivating the enzyme with heat or other various techniques.